In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to get your webhook secret in Stripe using a few simple steps covered in about five minutes. First, navigate to Stripe's website. This is the essential step to ensuring you're in the right place. So open your browser and type in stripe.com or click the Stripe link if you have easy access to it. Once on the Stripe homepage, your next move should be to sign in. Look for the sign in button, usually at the top right of the page and give it a click. This will take you to the login screen where you'll need to enter your email and password. Make sure these are accurate to avoid any access issues. After you've entered your credentials, hit the sign in button again to enter your Stripe dashboard. Now you'll be on the home page of your dashboard which is like the command center for all your Stripe activities. Scroll down until you see the developers section. This is where you'll review various developer tools and settings including those related to webhooks. In the developers section you'll find an option labeled webhooks. Click on it to proceed to the next step in our journey. Now to set up your webhook, you'll click on Add Destination. This is crucial as it defines where Stripe sends event information. Without this setup, you wouldn't receive the critical data necessary to handle Stripe transactions. Once you've clicked Add Destination, you'll be directed to make specific selections. Start with Checkout, then choose Checkout.Session.Completed. This type of event is crucial for processing completed checkout sessions, ensuring your website reacts correctly to a successful transaction. After making those selections, proceed to invoice and select invoice.payment.succeeded. This helps you get notified every time a payment related invoice goes through successfully. With your selections in place, click continue to advance to the endpoint configuration. Here you'll see a space labeled webhook endpoint. You'll be pasting a URL here which serves as the address for where Stripe will send the webhook information. Take a moment to enter the exact URL you want as the recipient of the data. Then below that you can add a helpful description to keep things organized. Use this as a reference point to remind yourself later what this webhook is set up for. Finally, click Create Destination to save your configuration. At this point, Stripe sets everything up on their server to start sending information to your specified endpoint, concluding the setup. With everything set, you've successfully obtained your webhook secret in Stripe. Now you're all set up to receive real-time event notifications from Stripe directly to your server. Make sure to test this setup in a safe environment to ensure everything is functioning as expected. And there you have it, simple, right? Thanks for watching and happy developing.